as she slowly lifted the lid and out popped a kangaroo mouse! Ah! Really? Only me? Nobody else thought that was scary? Dude, come on. A kangaroo mouse? I'll have you know that kangaroo mice can be surprisingly large. Name something you don't find surprisingly large. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first of all, rude. Second of all, valid. This is so fun. Camping in the desert was a great idea. <laughs> Agreed. The night sky is so vivid. Plus, there are hieroglyphs of an ancient rain dance right here. Totally. And another great thing about the desert are those red glowing eyes over there peering out at us from the darkness. What? <laughs> Calm down. It is merely I, the one known as Orange. Ah, orange? You made me peddle my law. What the heck were you doing out in the woods like that anyway? Huh? I was using a latrine far from camp. Urine can attract wildlife, specifically kangaroo mice. What? Uh, is that true? I will verify. Allow me a moment to access my hard drive. Er, I mean, Earthling brain. Hold on. Guys, does something seem weird about him? The one known as Orange? Yeah, nothing is weird about me. And the kangaroo mouse factoid is true. Changing topics, would all of you please follow me out into the darkness now? Okay. Not so fast, Marshy. Remember what we talked about? Oh, right. Ahem. I'm skeptical. Why do you want me to follow you into the darkness? Much better. Uh, the reason I want you to follow me, it is because, um, I want to show you a, uh, can of Mountain Dew. Bro, we have Mountain Dew right here. Uh, uh, this can of Mountain Dew is behind, uh, a log? Yay! Really? Show me the way. What? Are you guys serious? He's obviously lying. He's just listing off objects he sees. Is it behind this log? No, that is a cactus. Well, I probably shouldn't stay here by this petal puddle since it can attract. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh, is it behind this log? No, that is also a cactus. Hey, here's a log. Very good, Pear. That is, in fact, the very log I was searching for. I will now go behind the log. In 11 seconds, join me. Okay, 11 seconds, huh? That's kind of an awkward amount of time. I wonder if I'll be able to fill in that time in a way that's engaging for an audience, or if I'll just stand here being boring until... Well, here goes nothing. Orange, I'm here, behind the log. Excellent work, X9-4444. Hmm, who are you talking to? I'm talking to you, obviously. Do you see any other body-stealing robots from outer space around? Well, you said X9-4444. My name is X9-4444. There is an extra four. Ah, yes. Well, surely you can understand the confusion. I cannot. Well then, back to the point. Once you have dressed yourself in this Earthling skin, hide its skeleton with the others. Then go take care of the remaining Earthlings. Mission Jump Scare All Earthlings is now entering phase two. Bwah, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> oh my god, 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 oh my god. Where am I? I feel like I'm going in circles. Why do I smell toast? Am I having a stroke right now? Ow! Hey! Ah! Relax, dude. It's me, Toast. What are you doing out here in the desert? I'm uh, just loafing around. I mean, think about it. I'm super dry. The desert's super dry. Yeah, well, I think we can go ahead and say my presence here has been sufficiently justified. Besides, I've been tracking the spaceship for weeks now. Spaceship? What spaceship? Oh, we should probably hide. Altitude 3.5 quibble sides, 1.2 quibble sides, zero quibble sides. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man! Engaging quibble light. Oh no! They found my friends! You sure they're your friends? Just watch. Password. Quibbles eyed. Wait, did you know that was the password? Or did you just hear us say it a bunch as we landed? I knew it. Although, to be fair, it is a very common word in our language. And your point is? 
Perhaps it is a poor password? Your mom's a poor password. Okay, that was unquibbles i called for. I'm sorry, I sincerely equibble jize. Now then, have you successfully jump scared all Earthlings in the vicinity? Nearly. Our scanners only pick up life forms of a certain size. And the Earthling we are searching for is, well, how do I put this politely? He's so short, he has to look up to look down. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck are you laughing at? What? It was funny. The audio scanners have detected something from over that away. Did, did we lose him? I think so! Okay, cool! We're back at my camp! Quick, let's- Earthlings, we have you surrounded. Simply give us your skin and no one has to get jump scared. Never! Besides, my skin doesn't come off very easily! I believe we've been through this! Ah, I have heard of you. On our home planet, you are known as the one who is so small he cannot be jump scared from his skin, or T O W I S S H C B J H S for short. Short indeed. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! I don't know which is worse, your humor or your acronyms. Probably our acronyms. As a race, we are very, very bad at naming things, but we are very good at separating Earthlings from their skin. Bring out the skin extractor! Oh man, 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 man! Big little apple, big! How did you stop these robot freaks in the past? With liquid, of course. Indeed, we have been thwarted twice before due to your wet antics. But not this time, for we have isolated you in the middle of a desert. Not a drop of water in sight. On three, everyone evil laugh. One, two... Wow. Too early, X9444. That isn't my name. That's because I wasn't talking to you. Start the skin extractor. No! No! Oogie boogie. Oogie boogie boogie. Um, uh, hold on. It didn't work. Impossible. Wait, let me see if I got this straight. The skin extractor just jump scares me? Why, yes. Why do you ask? Well, it's pretty well established by this point that I'm too small to jump out of my skin! Told you that it wouldn't work. Shut up, X94444. What did I say? Ugh, these names are awful. Like, when I first saw this thing, I was sure it was gonna cut my skin off! I see. Well, we don't have that technology. But no matter. Mission Jump Scare All Earthlings will succeed. We will jump scare his skin off, and we will do so now! Set the skin extractor to max level! Ah! Ah! Keep it together, little apple! I know you can! Wait a minute! It's not working. Turn it up to beyond max level! There's a beyond max level! Ah! Ah! Yeah! No, no, it cannot be! I won't let you die, X44444! Four, 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 four. That's not my name! That's it. Too annoying. Go ahead and die. Ah! Deploy the water shield! We must make it above the clouds before our shields fail! Almost there! I'll check. Nope. It doesn't look... And then it was simply a matter of reuniting everyone's skin with their skeleton. You, uh, you sure you paired everyone's skin to their skeleton correctly? I mean, it was really dark, but I'm pretty sure. Why do you ask? Um, no reason. <laughs> Who's this? Slice to meet you. <laughs> You trying to get a rise 
out of me. You better mollow out. <laughs> <laughs> Bready or not, here I come. <laughs> Stop! I can't take any more. I am cautiously optimistic that they'll be at that for days, which means they won't be bothering us. I see this as an absolute win. 